I've got the rain boots on. Oh boy. Yeah. Got my rain boots. And we got a nice lovely day. This video today is gonna be a little bit different. Howdy. Howdy. Like that rain. Howdy, what is up guys? Welcome back. Starting out a little different. Something new on the agenda today. Sash, what are we making? Fish chili. Fish chili. I don't know, she came up with the idea. Perfect rainy day conditions for a nice warm meal and I was like, all right, let's go do it. Might be good, might not be. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> you guys seem to like the experiments in the kitchen, so we're like, you know what? We're gonna devote a video just for an experiment in the kitchen. But if you guys have been keeping up with the videos, you know we did a paddlefish trip down south in the old Missouri. And we're gonna cook one of those today. If you guys haven't been watching, I'll put a sneak peek right here. Oh, oh my gosh! That's a fish, yep. That's a fish. Just slow and steady. Woo. That's good. Whoa. A hundred and five. Holy snaggies. I'll link the two below. We still have two coming out. These ones are pretty good. We had a lot of fun, maybe too much fun at some times. And we got some big boys, so. So if you haven't been keeping up with those, I'll link those down below. I'll put a sneak peek right here again. We got two, we got two, we got two. Someone grab that one, definitely a fish. We got two down, two more to come out. You guys have been requesting a catch and cook for that, so we're gonna make a whole video out of it. Perfect rainy day conditions for a nice warm fish chili, so. We got the rain boots on. Yum. Yee -hee. Lots of the experiments actually turn out pretty good. Like the fish pizza we did a couple videos ago, that was actually very good, so. All right, let's go. Oh, wow. Oh, it's sleeting out. Ooh, that smells good. Yeah, it smells like some barbecue chicken. <laughs> Heavy. Yeah, already. Orange. Um, and this one looks good. Oh yeah. Jalapeno. This one looks pretty good. What else we need, Sash? We need tomato paste, sauce, I guess, and then hamburger. Oh, we need an onion. Oh, this The onion. This looks good enough. That'll work. Shoreland's home style chili with beans is a hearty blend. Makes eight servings. Find it. Oh, is this what we're making? Yep. So you guys can come to your local Hy-Vee or Menards. We actually got it at Menards and it's a shore lunch home style chili. Um, we're doing it with fish and hamburger. So it's going to be interesting. Okay. Do you have any recommended one you like? What are you making with it? Pizza or are you just- Oh, uh, we're doing a chili. chili. Oh, cool. Thank okay. you so much. Okay, thank you. Oh, perfect. Two of these. Just need a thing of hamburger. Tomato sauce, ground beef, cooks in 25 minutes. And then we're just gonna add our own with these ingredients. Yep. Pepper, uh, two. Yep. Yeah. Hey! Twenty-four. Eighteen. Cheese. <laughs> so, yep. There you go. All right. Thank you. Back out to the rain we go. Fish chili. Here we come. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Another reason we're not fishing today is the temperature dropped about 25 degrees from yesterday. We're just on the verge of nice weather. It's about uh, 48 degrees today instead of about 75 how it has been in the 402. So we figured the fishing is not going to be any good, so we're going to catch y'all in the kitchen. Just pee in the air. <laughs> Chef Pierre! Not going to show that. Paddle fish chili. Yum. That's a nice old paddle fish right here. Made the old switch to the bush light. Can't drink the Bud Light anymore. Don't want to drink tranny fluid. Cheers, y'all. Yep, still raining. All right, Sash, tell us a little bit about this. Honestly, I found this at Menards and I was like, 
It'd be interesting. Yeah, yeah. Now back to the prepaid programming. Well, boom. Specific. Six cups of water. Nice, fresh, white fillets. Paddlefish is very well known for being really good. We're gonna try it in chili, so we won't get the actual taste of the paddlefish, but you can see how clean it is. It's uh, just a little bit different, kind of like a meaty fish. You're gonna dry her off, mm, that is good. Whoa, well, bam. Usually we fry the fish with beer batter or some other type of short lunch. I think we're just gonna do oil and the fish, maybe a little bit of seasoning, and throw it all in the chili. We do have, can I grab those? We do have a little bit of lemon lime and chili lime that we're gonna throw in there, so. So for those of you that didn't see it the first time, homestyle chili is just a shore lunch. It's actually a soup mix. So we are gonna do the chili with the beef, also with the fish in there. Yes. And give her a go. We're experimenting in the kitchen yet again. Doing something completely out of the ordinary. Fish, beef, chili with uh, some veggies and Ooh. stuff. We got a whole concoction of different things. That smells good. You wanna smell? We got a whiskey in there. And your beans. Ta-da. Next is tomato sauce. What? Look at this. <laughs> How the hell do you do that? You got it. There's one can. The meat. We have the meat. Ta-da. No splash. Yep. <laughs> a little chili check. That actually looks pretty good. It smells good that too. Smells so good. It's a little liquidy right now. Yeah. We'll get there. Onion. Chili lime. Going out the feet. Jalapeno. All right, there you have it. Nice little veggies. How's the chili kind of? Pretty good. She's on chili duty. Chili, what is it, 25 minutes? You wanna stir it occasionally every 25. Well, let it sit for 25 minutes and then stir it occasionally. We gonna be eating good on this nice rainy day. Right, buddy? Nux. Look at that goodness. Mm. Ground beef, paddlefish, chili. What a nice cold rainy day. There's another look at the fish right there. It actually turned out very well. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Only thing to make this rainy day better, some Shania Twain. Body. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, come on, chase me, chase me. <laughs> Attack! Huh? Squirrel? <laughs> oh, that looks good. 
Whoa! Whoa! Wait, wait. <laughs> Fire in the hole! Ta-da! Pretty good easy meal. Paddlefish cooks very fast, and honestly, we didn't cook it with any other beer batter or short lunch on top of it, and it still came out with a nice kind of crust on it. That is one thing you can do. We put the chili lime, well, it's actually these two right here. But honestly, I got this at a gas station, Twanger's Classic, and the lemon lime mixture that's also the Twanger's Classic. And then we're gonna top it with some Red Hot. Um, worked pretty good, honestly, it looks great. Look at that stuff right there, guys. You wanna add the Red Hot? Just a little bit. I think it's kind of spicy already, but we really? can add a little bit of that. Shake, 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 shake. <laughs> and add a little bit of the red hot for good measure. Gotta have a little bit of twang and kick with the chili. That looks very good. Finished product. Look at that. This cooks so fast. Still recording. Hello, YouTube. All right. Finished product, the paddlefish going in the chili. Mm. Gonna dry it off real quick, get her in the chili. Voila. Five minutes. Sicker boy, sicker. Get her. Sit. Hey, bye. Hey, Knox. He's like, you ain't got no treat, fool. Back to the prepaid pool gaming. Actually, look, we got about, what, four minutes left? That looks pretty good. It is time. Yeah, she looks. Oh yeah. Look at that. Paddlefish chili. Give her a whirl. Ooh, big chunk of paddlefish. Hi, hi. Mmm. Good? Mm-hmm. How is it compared to regular chili? A little different? Mm -hmm. Really? Mm-hmm. How's the paddlefish? Good. Good? Nice and tender. Nice. Piece of paddlefish in there. Get some peppers. That chili stuff is really good. Paddlefish is nice and tender. You can taste the paddlefish. Yeah. It uh, tastes a little bit different. Really Very good, good though. though. Highly recommend. Going in for one without the paddlefish. That chili sauce is really good. God, hot. <laughs> All right, y'all. Well, we're going to snack on this. Nice little adventure while we had the rain out here. Paddlefish chili. Kaboom! Honestly though, very good. Y'all gotta try it sometime. Another experiment in the kitchen down. If you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. I know there wasn't any fishing in there. We threw some clips and stuff, but we do have two more paddlefish videos yet to come. Like I said, we got some big ones. But all in all, chili paddlefish, highly recommend. Good by him. Good work, Sox. This is a good idea, so. Hope you all enjoyed today's video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget that subscribe button. I'll catch you on the next adventure. Have a good one. Peace. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. You can tell. <laughs>